Oh, there she goes, Jim. Oh, no. Frank. Thanks a lot for coming along with Life with Belsif. Let's see what's really going on. How you doing today? Welcome to Life with Belsif. Today is a sad day. We sold decent the golf cart. Got a guy coming around. I shouldn't say we sold it. I'm pretty sure we sold it. The guy's bringing a tarp money and everything else. So I'm pretty sure she's going to be gone tonight. So I was having a really hard time deciding. I decided it's time for it to go. And instead of banking the money on this one, this one's buying me a new iMac that will do 4K video editing so I can put out some real good quality content. Now let me rephrase that. Put out some good quality resolution. Can't really say it's good content. Well, maybe. You guys can let me know below. A lot of you are fans for life and I appreciate it. Remember, don't forget, if you want stickers, PM me and I'm sending out a certain amount of quantity of stickers for free. So just PM me with your address and I'll just start picking people and sending stickers to you. I want to spread my stickers throughout the world, I do, so everybody knows what Life with Bills is all about. Why wouldn't we? Hey, we could do that together. We'll grow together, we will, with your help. So PM me with your address and we'll get some stickers your way. I can only do so many, remember, because it costs me money to send stickers and make stickers. So I can only give so many away, but I'll do my darn best, I will. So not everybody's gonna get them, but a lot of you will. So you never know, and I'll do this every, every so many months, I'll do it again. And I'll just do that. Let me know in the comments below, because I like to give back somewhat for free. I know it's, you never really give anything for free, but we have to sometimes, because I care about you guys, and I'm glad you're all here. But it's a sad day, like I said, for Decent, because Decent's gonna be going, I'm, I'm almost cried last night. I didn't sleep at all last night. Fuck. I, I, I was tossing and turning. I had a dream that, me and him were sitting down by the beach with a drink of coffee, watching the waves come in. And he said, hey, Bill. So, and I said, hey, Decent, you're running good today. And he goes, yeah, I always run good for you, Bill. So you built me and I'm very, very healthy. So I talked to it last night. I said, listen, Decent, I'm gonna have to maybe let you go. You know, I've got blue balls and I just gotta explode and let you go. Frig, it's pretty tough, but I had fun with you. You're a great little two-stroker, but in my future, I see maybe a seasonal site coming up, and I know a lot of campgrounds only allow electric. So that's another reason why I'm hanging on to blue balls and not decent, because one day we might stick the trailer somewhere seasonal, and that way we can just head her over there. What do you think? Leave your comments down below. If you have a seasonal trailer, why wouldn't you? Screw cancer, Captain. Why wouldn't you? Frig, I would. But we're heading home. This guy's supposed to meet me at my house. Like I said, there's a big storm coming by the looks of it. Look at the clouds back there. They look mad. Asty, but we'll tarp her up if he buys her and away you go 72 hours later didn't even get to finish my video of saying bye to decent and it's the next day and i'm already going to see decent because decent got mad at me obviously and the radio just quit working on the stupid thing so i stopped the canadian tire bought a new head unit for it we're gonna go down there change that out get it going and then say goodbye forever I hope. Well, I'm going to say goodbye forever because I can't keep going back to fix things. It's theirs now. But out of the goodness of my heart, we'll change the head unit out because it was working in my garage and they got home it wasn't working. And I knew that it got wet up once upon a time. So pretty sure it probably needs to be changed. So we'll just change it. Just out some time and a nice little drive. So what the hell? Wine's all eh? Who wants to go? You? Perfect. It's about an hour's drive and here we go. Can't believe the gas prices right now. If you don't go to the reserve, you're looking at a buck 37 for fuel, and that's a liter for you Americans, not a gallon. So it pretty much for a 90 liter tank in my truck, what's that in gallons? I don't know. What's hey Siri, what is 90 liters in gallons? One gallon is 3.79 liters. Hey Siri, how many gallons in 90 liters? The answer is one meter gallon. One meter gallon, that makes a lot of sense. Anyways, three liters per US gallon, so there you go. So figure it out, 90 liters cost me 100 bucks Canadian. Cap. Anyways, the fuel prices are ridiculous. I might have to get myself a little four cylinder car. Why wouldn't I? We're on the highway now, we're on the good old 402 skins. So we're gonna take a little ride and get ourselves there and get ourselves home. Erga. Just had a guy and a wife go by me on a bike and I gave him the thumbs up and then we slowed down and he handed me a card, he did. So hey, if you're on Facebook, go check him out, why wouldn't you? Custom canvas, eh? Alright, get better. I would, but we're in London now. 
we're just getting off on Highbury here. We're gonna go, we're almost there. We got, it says, arriving in five minutes. Captain? Well, seven minutes, I apologize. 10 minutes and we'll be there. Well, there we go. We got the stereo in. The only problem is it was a deeper one, so it bottomed out, but they're gonna have to just uh, fix that themselves, they are. I replaced the head unit with a brand new one. Now they got a CD player too, and they're gonna have to get a little extension piece for it, but they're all fixed up and it's where it was the head unit. It was just cocked right over to him. Look at this thing. Yeah, a little on the dirty side she is. So that's what happened to that. She just gave up the ghosties. Which is alright, you know, it happens. So what happens if Gatlin gives you radio, it's a piece of garbage, eh Gatlin? Why wouldn't you buy it? <laughs> I think he's less than a piece of paper. <laughs> Gatlin. We're gonna head home here. I think it's 6.30, so we made pretty good time. We weren't there too long. Hopefully I got all my shit. I never even thought about double checking. So I get that, get that, get that. I got my torch. Oh, dick. I think I forgot my solder pan. I better pull over and look. Frick, what happened? I can't forget soldering gun, Captain. Oh, fuck. Get it back. El no go on the Sado Oingano. It was under the seat. <laughs> well, they went back again. But hey, why wouldn't I? They're in a cool little spot back there. There's a big giant park with a pond. And I see him going out driving around that, so that'd be kind of friggin' neat. Friggin' right it would. Huh. Get home for decent. Friggin' right it is. Get ready to spend some money. That's all I can say. You're always fixing golf carts. Always! That was my journey for the last couple days. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification. I appreciate y'all being here. Welcome any new subscribers to the channel. Don't forget to hit that like button. What else have I forgot? Don't forget to do this, that, and the other freaking thing. And until next time, you know what to do for now.